Well, hello everybody. This is uh, Mojo from 3 guitarcom and MojoCaster.com. Um, usually I play uh, with uh, my doctor's e and Gia, but lately I've also been playing with uh, this here beautiful thing. And this here beautiful thing is also known as a car hammer head. Um, a lot of different settings. You have to excuse a little bit of dirt on the thing. Well, not dirt actually, but uh, um, well, probably some dust. So anyway, we have the volume, then we have impact, we have the master, and grip. I will be going through all those different settings later on uh, with the guitar actually plugged in. Hey, look at my old friend Adobro in the background. Anyway, uh, it is a hammerhead. It does have a standby, and would you know, it's got that beautiful little bright emerald green thing going on. Oh, and look at that, my first guitar ever in the background, and you probably recognize this one if you've ever listened to any of my stuff. And by the way, this is our... Reverend Rocco, because must have a Reverend Rocco specifically in uh, Lava Swirl. Anyway, this is the front of the uh, of the amp. Uh, very classy design, uh, all handmade and uh, fantastic uh, quality. This one uh, uh, came to me almost by surprise. I wasn't really looking for an amp, but uh, considering the quality of these things, I just had to get one. You can see the tubes in the back and. If I can stretch this thing, here is the um, speaker. All right, so let's play a little bit with it, just so we can get a feel for what it sounds like. I apologize for the jerkiness here, but I figured it was worth actually looking at the thing a little bit. So here we are. All right, let me grab a guitar, and we can start having some fun. Whoopsie. Maybe not the best way. Guitar today, by the way, will be uh, my trustful old friend, also known as Old Flamey. And, uh, well, she's my pride and joy. All right. <laughs> change some stuff in there. I'm going to change the impact and put it on the uh, lower setting. A little bassier. Let's change the uh, to the uh, next level up. Oh yeah, it's doing the twang thing. Twang pretty well, huh? I didn't change anything else, by the way. Just that one thing called impact. Pretty twangy, pretty spanky. Next level up is the fourth level on the impact knob. Still a little louder uh, and still a different, uh, different uh, sort of tonality to it. start playing with the uh, the grip um, knob so I have it all the way down bring it one up again clearly a lot more uh, gain automatically with it a little bit more muffled here 
and matching the uh, impact and the grip. For example, there I got the uh, uh, grip all the way up and impact all the way down. the impact one more and the grip is all the way up again. Again that very spanky uh, feeling we got at uh, level uh, three or two pardon me of the impact that we mentioned earlier on. at all since the beginning, so I'm going to do so now. I'm going to bring up the volume. So it's got a lot of crunch in it. Um, for the record, the, uh, the master right now is probably at like 1.5 out of 10. Uh, this puppy can get loud. Alright, this was a uh, quick little demo of my uh, car ha um, hammerhead amp. Uh, as you can see, it's very versatile. It's got a lot of different tones to it. Uh, very easy to dial them in. And uh, if you ever have a chance to, uh, to try a car amp, I uh, recommend you do just that. And if you have a chance to acquire one, then I recommend you jump on it. Have a great day. Thanks for watching. Bye.